So here in this video, we're going to have a look at something that can pop up in the gradebook from time to time. So if we come to our grades, then you can manually override grades within your gradebook by clicking on the grade item and then either entering a value, if it's kind of zero to 100% mark, or if it's pass fail, actually entering a pass or fail. But what happens if we want to remove this yellow mark that pops up when we have overridden a grade within the grades page. So in order to do this, we're going to come up to turn editing on. And then in here, we can click the gear icon and we can uncheck overridden and then save those changes. I'll click continue here. So basically we can do this for each of these and you can see that it is now removed that yellow mark on that grade item. So we'll uncheck the last one that we have here, come back to our gradebook, we'll leave these ones as is. Now, you may also have seen your gradebook look like this, where it's kind of opened up and it's got these gear icons all over the place. To change it back to its default state, then we just click turn editing off and that will change it back to its default state. And you can see those yellow marks have been removed for those grades that were previously overridden. So again, if we go to turn editing on, We'll come down to here, we'll uncheck overridden, save changes, click continue, and then we'll come back to turn editing on. And you can see as well as it, the overridden element being removed, it removes the grade that was given before. So for instance, if we override a grade here, and then we come into turn editing on, and we'll uncheck overridden and hit save changes and continue. Close this. The grade reverts back to its original grade. So this was a assignments total for all these assignments, but if we do it for a regular assignment, then you can see when we turn editing on and then remove that override, save those changes, click continue and then turn editing off, that new grade that we entered, so 66, has been removed from the grade where we, we entered it. So we can remove the overridden grade, we just need to go in, turn editing on and uncheck it, but just bear in mind that it will actually remove the grade as well when you remove that overridden element. Hope this is helpful. If you have any questions, then please do get in touch.